another video. My name is Sophie, in case you're new around here. Thanks for clicking on this video. Welcome to my channel. Um, today I'm actually filming a Target fall clothing haul. I think this is probably by far the biggest, the biggest Target clothing haul I've ever done, which I'm very excited about because they finally got some fall stuff in. I actually was there a couple days ago um, and I was looking for fall decor to do like a fall decor haul because I did one last year and it went over really well. Um, but they haven't really gotten any fall decor in yet. They've got like a couple little random things here and there, but nothing that I could like do a proper haul on or enough things that I actually want. Hopefully they'll be coming out with some more cute fall decor pieces soon, but their clothing section is full of lots and lots of really cute stuff. I'm excited to show you what I got. I'm excited to try on this clothes. So let's just get right into it. I literally have a mountain of clothes sitting next to me I'll insert a photo or like a little video where you can see what a mess it is but I had to like dump all the bags of clothes out because I didn't want to like rustle the plastic up every time I went to grab something but before I dive into the mountain of clothes next to me I thought I would show you what I'm currently wearing because it is a purchase from Target that I got today and I thought it was just like a cute cozy little thing to wear while I film it's actually a sweat set and look how this color matches my nail polish perfectly isn't that funny? This is an OPI gel, by the way. It's called Icelanded, Icelanded, a bottle of OPI. So that's that. So as always, I'll like hold up the clothes, show you what I got, and then do a little other section cutaway where I am showing you in the mirror and talking you through if I like it or not, what it feels like on, how it fits, etc. But this is what I'm currently wearing to film in, this little sweat set. It's really, really comfy. It's not the most flattering, I would say, at all. Um, but I feel like sweat sets just typically aren't that flattering on me. The shorts I got in a size medium. I feel like they're a little bit big. I wish they were a little shorter, um, but they didn't have a size small. And then the top, I also got a medium. So medium top, medium bottoms. Again, not the most flattering, but I really like the color and it's really soft and cozy. And it's just something nice to throw on when you're like lounging around the house. So I'm quite happy with it. Okay, now let's get into the mountain of clothes. By the way, I like to tell prices of everything because I just feel like it's helpful. So the top, I did get it in a medium and it was $18 and the bottoms also medium $15 um, and I will be posting everything in the description um, with links so that you can shop them if you want to. Now it's time to get into this mountain of clothes next to me and start trying stuff on. So here we go. I know it's kind of hard to see what something looks like when I'm just holding it up like this but don't worry I will try everything on and cut away between every piece. So first things first I got this. I wanna call it a shawl. I don't know, I'm not exactly sure what you call these. Do you see what I mean? How it's just kind of like a blanket that you drape over your shoulders, except that it has armholes. So I think you call this a shawl, shawl? I feel like that word is hard to say, but anyway, this is a piece that I think I will be wearing a lot this fall because I do live in Florida, so it's kind of nice to have your arms out. Also, of course, you can wear this with sleeves to make it like warmer and really a really cute like layered look. It's very, very soft, and I just love things like this that are just sort of like oversized and flowy, um, and you can wear over leggings, just like a really easy outfit. So grab that. It is one size fits most, and it was $25, so let's try it on. Okay, first thing I'm trying on, I love it i feel like this is very fall appropriate but it's also great for florida fall where it's like actually not hot at all i really feel like this little top would kind of work good with so many different outfit options you could belt it you could put like a collared long sleeve under it you could just put like a short sleeve collar i feel like you could build so many cute little fall outfits out of this one piece a little crossbody moment with the bag i feel like it's just a really cute little simple fall outfit i feel like i talk about my little coach bag in every single video but i actually am obsessed with it, it goes with everything like it just elevated this whole outfit so much these jeans are from h&m by the way and these shoes i'll be showing you at the very end of this video because i almost forgot to show you that i got them as well from target next up is a little dress it's really lightweight and it actually kind of has a summery feel to it but i feel like the colors and like something about it also feels kind of fall to me it's one size fits most as well it was $28 and I just really like the colors, neutral stripes. I think it's really pretty. I am such a sucker for anything comfy, oversized, flowy. So when I find really cute pieces that are like that, that you can just throw on and like be in an outfit just with some cute little accessories, I am all about it. And I feel like this dress is gonna be a perfect little fall end of summer staple. Okay, unfortunately, this piece is a no-go. Even though it is really, really cute, I did not realize that it had this big slit in it. I thought it was a dress, and it's not a dress. It's just like a really long top. I feel like it could be cute with maybe like black leggings and boots and stuff, 
but definitely doesn't look good with my biker shorts. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't know, I really wanted to love this. I just didn't realize that it wasn't an actual dress. But anyway, I don't think it's gonna work, so. That was that. Next up is something I actually got in two different colors. It's this really frilly, girly kind of top. I'm not totally sure about it. We're gonna have to see what it looks like on, but I thought it would be interesting to try it on and see what we thought, but it's this really pretty like burnt orange rusty color. It has a really cute like Peter Pan collar um, and it just screams fall to me. Obviously this color is like fall in a color but i love all the little girly ruffles and details it sort of has like a floral embroidery pattern all the way through it i got it in a size medium and it was 24.99 and i also got it in white where's the white one did i get it in white oh yeah i did i did i did here it is in white same exact shirt just a different color and i actually got the white one in a size small just to see because you never know it's always hard to tell with sizing what's going to look best um so yeah let's try these on okay here's the shirt in the first color i don't hate it but i'm not like 100 percent sold on it i don't know if it's like completely my vibe see these are the sleeves like normal but i just like bunched them up at the elbow i don't know what i think i actually tried them on with blue jeans with shorts and i feel like it would just like wasn't really working i feel like this works the best so far with black jeans let me know what you think because i'm not 100 percent sure about this shirt but i'm excited to try it on white because I do like the fit, I just I do think it could be a little bit smaller. So let's try it on in a small white version. Okay, here it is in white. I'm still not loving it. I think I'm probably gonna return both of these. It's definitely just like a tiny bit too small in the size small around the neck. Um, it just like is a little bit tighter and like around the bust area. So I don't think I'm gonna keep it. I, I really wanted to be able to pull this off, but I feel like it's just not my vibe at all. But I definitely do feel like some people will look really cute in this. Like some people can really like pull off this whole Peter Pan collar girly frilly vibe. I just don't think it's for me, but anyway, I tried. I also picked up this really, really soft white button down shirt. I think it's just cotton, but it's really soft. It kind of has like a linen vibe to it, but it definitely feels full. It was $20. I got actually two sizes of this as well. I got a large to see what like an oversized fit would look like. And then I think I also got it in a small. Oh, I got a large and a medium. So we'll see which one works better. I feel like this could be such a staple for me throughout fall and winter and like even summertime because it's just a simple white button down, but it feels really soft. I'm, I think it has like a relaxed fit to it because the material is really soft and relaxed. So I'm excited to try this on. Well, both of the sizes and let you know what I think. Okay, the white button down, I am in love. This is the size medium. I really like the way it fits. I'm gonna try on the large as well and see if I like it a little bit better, but it's just so, so, so comfy and soft. And it just like looks so good. I feel like this is gonna look good with so many outfits, just like a, a staple item. Um, it definitely is more lightweight on than I thought it would feel, like it doesn't feel really warm. So it definitely would work in all of the seasons, which is great. I already know I'm gonna be wearing this nonstop, so very, very happy with this purchase. Next up are a really fun pair of trousers or pants. I think they're really cute. I really like the color. I like the check pattern. I don't actually have any pants that look like this at all, so it'll be f <laughs> so it'll be nice to have something like this in my wardrobe. But yeah, we're gonna spice things up with these pants. I got them in a size eight. I think it was the only size that they had left at my Target, um, and they were twenty-five dollars. So very excited to try these on. They're very stretchy, so hopefully they'll be flattering. Um, yeah, let's try them on. Okay, here are the pants. I don't hate them but I'm a little bit undecided. I can't tell if I love them or not. I think it's just like maybe not with this shirt. They're very like fitted and skinny at the ankle, so I feel like they're more of like an oversized top kind of vibe. Um, but I really, I think I like them. I think I like them. I just need to like figure out how to style them better, but like so far they're really, really comfy. The eight fits me like a glove. Um, so yeah, let me know what you think and how you would style these because I'm not like a fashion queen. I just like find things cute, you know? I don't know. Okay, next are a pair of pants that I'm definitely not sure about, but I couldn't leave the store without ha getting them to try them on. They definitely give me like tomboy vibes, um, but they are really cool. I think that they're gonna be a cool fit. Hopefully they're kind of like loose jogger stuff. Not even jogger. What, what, I don't know how to explain these, but I got them in a size medium. $25. I'm not sure what else to say about these pants at the moment. I just feel like I need to try them on and see what happens But I just felt like they were really cool and I can kind of envision like a really cool 
fall outfit with them. We'll see if I can make them work. I don't know, we'll see. You guys, these pants absolutely came through for me. I don't know if you're like seeing the vision like I am right now, if they're like very flattering on camera. I feel like they're not flattering on camera, but in real life, they are so cute. Very much like cool girl vibes, in my opinion. I was very, very unsure, but I'm like really, really in love with them. So I'm very, very happy. Why am I saying everything twice? I don't know, but I love them. <laughs> okay, I guess we'll keep going with this pants theme, but I got another pair of trousers. They're actually the exact same as the other ones, just a different print and a different size because they only had a 10 left um, in this particular style. But I really like the color of these. I like the pattern. I feel like they're gonna be cool, so we'll see if they fit and how they go. But yeah, like I said, they're the same as the um, other checkered pants that I had. They're really stretchy um, and $25. Okay, I'm not loving these pants as much as I like the checkered ones. First of all, they're size 10, so they're a little bit bigger and I feel like they're just like not quite as flattering. Um, I don't know, I just like they're a little bit boring. But I will say they're very comfortable and I can imagine these being really cute if you like styled them up the right way. Okay, we're gonna spice things up with a dress. This is a really cute dress. I really hope it looks good on me because I feel like I could wear this to a lot of fun parties, nice dinners, etc. It's always hard to show you a dress like this, but I'll try it on soon. Um, it has a little belt tie detail, like three quarter length sleeves ish they're definitely not long sleeves but they're not short sleeves it's hard to tell if it's a wrap dress or not it kind of looks like it is but then i think it's like sewn in so maybe it's like a fake wrap dress um but anyway we're gonna try it on we're gonna see what we think so far i'm loving the whole vibe of it but i just don't know if it's gonna work on me because it's like quite long i got it in a size small it was 27.99 these prices are so good it is quite a lightweight material but obviously it's like very very full so I'm very excited to try this on. Hopefully it doesn't do me dirty. <laughs> okay, we're gonna pretend like this never happened, like you never saw this, but for the sake of the video and like transparency, I'm just gonna show you what I look like in this and it's not cute, so. <sighs> I, I have no words. I look like Little House on the Prairie times 1000, something like that. This would look really cute on a very tall, slender woman. Those are two things that I am not. So, this is going back immediately. Pretend you never saw this. I'm burning this footage. Oh my gosh, okay, this next piece I actually got in two sizes as well because I wanted to make sure that I got one that I loved because it's probably the one thing that I'm the most excited about um, if it looks good on me. So, it is just this little cardigan. It's actually pretty thick and like heavy, so it's gonna be really cozy and warm. But look how cute, sorry, I'm having, I'm struggling to show you what it looks like. Look how cute. Okay, you can see it better because this one is buttoned up, but isn't that just the sweetest, coziest, most fall little cardigan you've ever seen? I'm so excited to try this on. I think I think it's gonna be definitely a keeper. I got it in a small and a medium um, just to make sure that I got the one that I wanted. Otherwise, I thought it might sell out because it is such a cutie. So I'm gonna try these on. By the way, they're very, very soft and they're quite thick, so I feel like they're gonna be really nice and warm um, and cozy. So I'm excited for it to get cold here in Florida. It's so hot right now. I'm definitely gonna need to go somewhere a little bit cooler sometime soon because I cannot wait for the weather to change in Florida. It takes till like November for it to start to cool down here and I'm not having it. I need a place to wear all these fall clothes. This cardigan is $27.99. I knew I was gonna love this cardigan, but I didn't know it was gonna be like my new favorite thing ever. It's incredibly soft. Um, this is the size small and I think I'm gonna definitely keep this one and return the medium because the medium's just a little bit too oversized. But yeah, very, very soft, not scratchy at all, which is like obviously a deal breaker for me. So I really love it. And it's cute also buttoned up. I'm gonna be wearing this all the time, all the time. Next up is a cutesy little plaid flannel shirt situation. This just like screams fall Hallmark channel vibes. Like, and I just kind of love that. That vibe has a time and a place. And I feel like I'm gonna find that time and place sometime this fall and I'm very excited to get to that place in my life. But do you see what I mean? It just absolutely screams Hallmark Channel. It's a really cute green color, like green and off-white. I got it in a size large and it was $20 and it is very, very, very soft. So, excited to try that on. Here is the Hallmark Channel shirt. I feel like it's actually so, so cute with these cut-off shorts. I feel like it's just a great little fall vibe. 
Vicky with a cute little hat. It's also incredibly lightweight and soft, so I feel like it's perfect for Florida fall. Um, but yeah, kind of love it. Next up, I got this really, really cute sweater vest. I feel like the sweater vests are so cool right now and so trendy. They have been for a little while, but for some reason I never got one. And I don't think I've ever had one in my life, maybe when I was little, but anyway, I just thought that this would look really cute. I can make some cute little fall outfits with it. Um, I got it in a size extra, extra large because I feel like oversized is the vibe with sweater vests and the smaller ones were like kind of tight looking. So I got the biggest size that they had, um, an XXL, it was $20. So we'll see if I can make this into a really cute outfit. We'll see. Okay, here's a sweater vest. I tried to style it up the best I can. I'm definitely not a big, big fan of this outfit, but you get the vibe. It's kind of cute. I feel like I would prefer a sweater vest that has maybe like a V here and is like even more oversized and long. So yeah, the hunt still continues with that. I don't not like it. I just don't like, I'm not obsessed with it, you know? Okay, we're nearing the end, you guys. It's been a journey. Next up is this gray cardigan. Um, I got it in size medium. It was $27.99 and it is very, very soft. And I've just kind of been on the hunt for big oversized cozy soft cardigans gray is definitely never like my first choice of a color to go for i usually like beige or white or you know brighter colors um but this just kind of spoke to me okay the gray cardigan I actually really really like it it kind of is like the exact same color as my black jeans i feel like i would mostly wear this just like with leggings my little lululemon align leggings but yeah just a cute little cardi also would be cute obviously worn open with a tank top underneath um, it is so soft, not scratchy. I feel like every single person needs a good, just classic, easy throw on cardigan like this that is so soft and cozy. I really like it. I don't really love it with these jeans, but the cardigan itself, love. Okay, we're almost done. I just have like two more things, but I'm gonna show you these joggers. Definitely not sure about them. I feel like the colors look different in the store. Am I crazy? Um, but I got them in size small, $20, and they're basically like a fancy, joggers they're more of like a businessy material but they're still joggers i don't know they're kind of confusing me and i'm kind of confused why i've got them i don't think i'm gonna love these i feel like i might be more excited about them if they were a different color but this color is throwing me off it's kind of like a mustardy pukey kind of color so i think i was just on a bit of a rampage just throwing stuff in my cart so I don't really have hope for these, but we're gonna try them on and we're gonna see. Okay, I do not hate these pants at all compared to what I thought I was going to hate them. Um, they are everything apart from the color I'm liking. I feel like the color is not showing as ugly on camera as it is in real life. Like in real life, it's like a very greeny, yellowy brown and it's weird. Um, but anyway, yeah, don't hate them as much as I thought I would, but I still think I'm gonna return them or like look for a different color. On to the last items. I actually got this little pajama set. That is kind of a wild card because it's kind of Christmas. Not kind of Christmas, it is Christmas. So I'm a little confused why Target already had this out, but obviously I'm not complaining. Christmas is my favorite. So I got these pajamas. I was thinking of my future self. I'm like, you know what, Sophie? You're gonna be upset if you didn't buy these and then at Christmas time, they don't have them anymore. And you're gonna say, gosh, I wish I bought those cute green striped Christmas pajamas back in August. So this is what they look like. They are the softest material. This brand, Stars Above, makes the softest stuff known to man. Like everything they make is so ridiculously soft and amazing. So I got these in a size small. They were $19.99 for the bottoms. They cinch in at the ankle, so we love that. And they are just like so sweet and Christmassy. They also had them in red. Um, like the same, but like red stripes instead. And those are really cute too. I feel like this would be really cute, like matching Christmas pajamas for like your family to get or like your sister or your best friend. Um, if one was like red and one was green. But anyway, love these. I just know I'm gonna love this and live in this all winter long. And then this is the top. Obviously it matches, has a little pocket. I got it in two sizes actually. I got a small and a medium. So I'll let you know which one I like the fit better of. Um, and it was also $19.99. So $40 for the whole set. Not terrible, but it's like not great for Target pajamas, but so soft and so, so, so cute. So, wow, okay, that was everything for this Target haul. You guys, I was this close to forgetting to show you the shoes. I can't believe I almost forgot, but anyway, got a pair of shoes. They're from Universal Thread. They are so cute. They're just like a little boot slide, little heel situation. I don't really know what to call them. I'm sure they have a real name, but can you see like the texture of these boots? They're really cool. They also come in black. 
um, I got a size 8 and I would say that they're definitely true to size like I'm usually between a 7 and an 8 usually more towards the seven, seven and a half. So they're like a tiny bit big on me, but I feel like it's gonna be fine. So we'll see. Also, they were only $29.99. And they seem like they're really, really well made. But yeah, that is what I almost forgot to show you. <laughs> so that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I would love it if you would leave a little comment below. Let me know what your favorite piece was and if there's anything that you wanna pick up for yourself and try on yourself. Oh, and before you go, please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And also follow me on Instagram. And on TikTok, actually. I've been really active over on TikTok and Instagram. So follow me on all the things. And I will see you in another video very, very soon. Bye. There is a life.